I'm really excited that the beach house is now complete in Seaside, Oregon, and the new office is also up and running. And here we see some of the build pictures along the way of the office, and we can see it from the studs all the way to when it's painted. This is my view out my window, which is really cool. That's called Tillamook Head, and I also see some of the beach as well. And this is after it's painted, and the floor is about to go on. Uh, we also put in all kinds of great studio equipment. Here I am building the half wall. I realized that I didn't really have a place to record, and so I needed to build a half wall so I could have some sort of a backdrop that didn't have a window or, or the attic type of slanted ceiling. So I had to put the wall up and also got a little bit of help from my wife as well, although I don't show her here because she doesn't like being on camera. And once this was done, got everything all painted up and I was able to start moving in some of the furniture. Here's the movers moving in my desk, and uh, they were not happy about moving that desk up. I'll tell you what, that was super heavy it's in three different parts. There's the dog tax being paid. There's Pixel. And I uh, had made a lot of mess, but uh, got it all recycled as much as possible. Here I am working late into the night putting the desk together, and it came in three different pieces. I'm sitting at that desk right now. And underneath there, I was able to uh, put in those trays, and those are for wires to hide all the wires underneath, which is really nice. Started bringing in some of my studio equipment, and including the soundboard that you see there. And I had actually had to get a second one as well. This is where I put in the counters. I bought the counters from Home Depot for a couple hundred dollars and put them onto these baker's racks. And uh, that allows me to have adjustable shelves as well as uh, not a permanent type of situation. So if I want to in the future, I can move those elsewhere, which is really nice. There's the touchscreen TV I'll be using for teaching lessons. And uh, this is the server cabinet I got from Canada. And I didn't realize how bad they were at writing directions up in Canada, but uh, step number one was put together the carcass. Could not believe that, and it all went downhill from there. But uh, two days and lots of help later, I finally got it all put together and now it is holding all the network equipment. So here we have all of the storage put in. I had lots of different bins full of parts. This is gonna be the shooting area for the teaching where I'll be standing up and uh, doing various different things in front of a whiteboard as well as a TV connected to this computer. This is the area of the desk all put up with the sound partitioning. And I had an idea for some artwork, and so I, I pulled that off the internet uh, from Crop Circles. And so I put that up on the wall with some help, and it looks really cool on the wall. Which when you're walking upstairs, you get to see that. And the light comes in a few weeks out of the year where it uh, reflects off of that. It looks like everything's on fire, so it's pretty neat. Here we are with a video tour of walking into the office and the studio. And this is the first thing that you're going to see is the artwork. view out the window. It's a cloudy, rainy day, so you can't see everything, but uh, it is pretty cool. Thanks for watching the video, and I hope you look forward to, as I do, a lot of the teaching that I'll be doing over the coming months and years.